Okay, we are back again with some more time granite. Yes. Now, according to my notes, Baron, question mark, bedrooms, trade, hospital, barracks. Okay. By notes, I mean like a note. Oh, what's this? Uh, Usu re ringed frill. Well, let's take a look at you before we uh, make any agreements. I mean, there's already we've already got two. Uh, we got three long-term resident things, so we can have a, another one. And they're a human. Uh, his hair is extremely long. His eyebrows incredibly low. High cheekbones, narrow head. Are we recording? Yes, we are. Good. Dark torp hair. And pale chestnut skin and dark torp eyes. Yeah, sure. Anyway. Yeah, the barren thing. Like, we did say that Shem should be, no, not Shem, Reg should be a Baron, but they aren't a Baron. So that is a bit strange. Maybe I cancelled it or something. I don't know. We also need a trade with the humans. The humans. <laughs> uh, let's just get these rings to them. Okay, bronze bars, nickel bars, trifle pewter bars, copper bars, brass bars, zinc bars, bronze bars, nickel bars. We're probably not going to take the gold bars. There we are. Silver bars, iron bars. We don't need gems. We have plenty enough gems. Ah yes, some cloth and leather. Yes, we'll take a bin load of leather, a bin load of giant cave spider silk. Uh, do we want the yak leather too? Well, it's cheap, relatively. We are making a big trade with these rings. These rings were a sound investment, I can see. Mixed items. Let's get a pigtail. Ah. Well, it all adds up, don't it? Okay. Do you really need this? I mean, it's more spider silk and we already got an entire... Didn't we? Yeah, we already got an entire giant cave spider silk, so we don't really need this. Uh, yeah, we'll take that. that too because it's cheap looking what's this well crafted bone amulet nothing special about it oh wait you're the mountain homes <laughs> uh, I'm silly that's why they're paying so much for the rings because they're the mountain homes I don't know why I said humans there it's the start of a recording you know You know, I think we've got all we need from this trade. Maybe just a little bit more material. Seventy for all of that, so yes. We'll have plenty of material to do our 
clothes making with. Oh, this is a. I don't know why this bit of sheep. Oh, it's sheep wool, but this sheep wool's the same. Oh, this bit's dyed, I see. Some of this stuff is dyed, that's why it's being more expensive. Good. Yeah. Will you take this trade? No. I shouldn't be surprised. Alright, how about we... Take off one of the, uh... Do we really need all this giant cave spider silk? It's a... Like... Hmm, no. No, we don't. Let's reconfigure this trade. Alright, they should accept a trade now, but I just want to get a little bit more out of them. No. How about no? Ah, shit. Okay, fine, fine. We'll give you a good offer. We'll give you a good offer, Will. How's that? Good. Good. Vukar was starting to get a bit annoyed. <laughs> uh. Okay. We're done. No more trader needed here. Alright. Hmm? Oh. <laughs> no, no, that's fine. In fact, I insist that you do it anyway. Come on. We need this done, you know. Okay, hopefully there will be water coming from there. I mean, we should probably set up the hospital even if there isn't. Because we can dig further down until we hit water. You know? In activity, it's not a meeting area, it's a hospital. Yes. It needs a bed in there, at least one bed, maybe two. Speaking of beds, after this we're going to need a look at the bedrooms. Oh yeah, also traction benches. We have tables, we do, but we also have the same number of chairs, don't we? No, we don't. Okay, good. So... Yes, construct me two traction benches, let's say. Yeah. Let's turn down the music. I fear it might be too loud. Is it too loud? I don't know. It looks a bit loud. It doesn't matter if it is or isn't. I'm turning it down anyway. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, speaking of the bedrooms... Yep, there's still bedrooms that need bedroom mink, bedroom forming, creating, words, sentences. <sighs> bed. Uh, bed. And a final bed. F K 
cabinet, cabinet, and another cabinet. And a chest. What's that button? It's F. Wait, no, that's a cabinet. It's a H. But we're already here now, so container. Container and container. Yeah, there we go. Why did I order a bunch of coffers? I think I did. Oh, I think I know why. What's this? Migrants? Oh, we're just putting in more bedrooms. Heh <laughs> uh. Sixty-one dwarves, seventy-eight bedrooms. That's a bit uh, little for the amount, isn't it, though? That's the problem. It's very hard to keep up. Mul it's very hard to keep up. You know, you always need more bedrooms on. You know. What? This isn't even a bedroom. Neither is this. Oh, we better make sure things are bedrooms. There's a... There's clothing on that and it's not even a bedroom legally. Okay. I mean, you know what I could do? I could, in theory, put a few beds in there and make that into a dormitory for excess dwarves. I could do that. I'm pretty... I think the person who owned that article of clothing just took it away. Oh yeah, we also need a doctor, don't we? You're the best doctor we got. You're not the best doctor in the world, but you have some medical experience, which is better than nothing. There's a traction bench too. Also, we should probably put a container or two in here to put medical stuff. And maybe a cabinet as well. I don't know if a cabinet is necessary. I can't be asked to check, but we're going to put one in anyway, just because it will look nice in that alcove there, in that little alcove, alcove. I mean, look, there's a hurt dwarf. They need some help. Oh, look, water. We have our well. <laughs> it's all working very well. <laughs> Marvellous. We need blocks. Well, there's something I didn't remember. It's okay, we can fix this really quick. Make me some blocks out of... Limestone, sure, why not? Do it now. As quickly as you can. We have a dwarf who does require medical attention. I... I don't see where they've went. Where are they? I didn't actually look at them when they were there, and they don't seem to be there anymore. Well, they're not there. Strange. Well, maybe that was all they needed. Someone to look at them and say, yeah, you've been hurt. And that's it. <laughs> Just confirmation that that is indeed the case. Maybe. There we go. One well. Also, might as well make some more buckets. I don't know. 
Maybe we need more buckets. We don't really, but we're gonna make more buckets just because. Bucket, bucket, bucket. Four of them, yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. Thinking, I don't know what I'm doing with this. Efficiency has never been a particular, you know, interest of mine with this stuff. I just kind of build bedrooms in whatever way I, you know, fancy. But I am sticking to a format of there being four squares of bedroom in these bedrooms. That is something I have decided for this fort. Yeah, see that's five. And we aren't doing that. Okay, that'll do for now. We'll see. We'll get those bedrooms done. And then we'll do more bedrooms. Oh yeah, there's also the barracks that we haven't done anything with. Uh, armor stand? Yeah, armor stand. We don't have an armor stand. Weapon rack? We don't have a weapon rack. <laughs> oh dear. Why are the... There's always going to be dwarves just sleeping where they're not supposed to be. Even though they have bedrooms. Even though everything... They have bedrooms. But they're still going to be sleeping on the floor. And then they're going to be upset that they slept on the floor. Even though they're the one who chose to sleep on the floor. Wooden armor stand. Wooden weapon. Wait, wooden weapon. I don't think that's a wooden weapon rack. I think that's literally a wooden weapon. I can't find it there, so we're just going to go and do it at the mason's workshop. You know, actually, since we're here, we'll also put the armor stands on there. They appear to have less work anyway. Yeah, we had a load of wooden scepters being made because they're going to pay good money for scepters. Well, what are you doing there? Hmm. 
No, not you. You there. Oh, you're building it. It's still not built yet, eh? <laughs> oh, dear. What's this? No. We have filled our capacity of guest bedrooms. Okay, we're going to have them uh, mine that, uh, that single block of gem that I really want because it's a gem. I don't know if I've made it clear before, but I really like the gems. I want them all. All for me. <laughs> gems. But yeah, we're going to get all the gems, you know. Smooth stone. Yes, we shall smooth me. <laughs> uh. You see, I'm also known as stone. Most places. To the point where I call myself stone, I've... Pretty much never refer to myself as Seashore's Wall. I am stone. You could call me Seashore's Wall, though, I suppose. Hey, I did choose the name. Also, that's all on high priority, isn't it? Because I didn't change the priority back to four. Also, I see a gem. Mind that gem. Hmm. Marvellous. And beds are still being made for our ever expanding bedrooms. No armor stand still. Okay, well, they're doing it. Hospital, more, more, m hospital and, and the, uh, I'm trying to come up with the title of this video. I can't just have videos be titled things like, a lot happens all the time. Hospital and the ever-present bedroom construction. Hmm. I suppose that would be Time Granite Part 12 Hospital and the never-ending bedroom construction. How do you feel about me coming up with the titles of the video that you're watching whilst you're watching the video? Like, you already see my final title. But I can't, because I'm in the past. Anyway, we're just gonna get a bedroom up while we're thinking about this. Okay.
Hospital. Hospital. Barracks. And the ever present bedroom construction. Because we are going to build that barracks. You know. Let's see how many characters that is. Because there is a character limit on titles, you know. I think it's a hundred, if memory serves, or maybe it's fifty. It's one of the two. Okay, well that's ninety-four, and I'm pretty sure I can do that. All right, that's going to be the title: Time Dwarf Fortress, Time Granite, Part Twelve, Hospital, Barracks, and the Ever-Present Bedroom Construction. Uh, is ever-present even a word? It feels like a word I just... No, ever-present is a word. <laughs> I am not... I did not somehow create a word in my head that was not a real word. Getting it, no, that's making it smaller. Okay, let's see. We got that armor stand yet? Yes, we do. Marvelous. And a weapon rack. Weapon rack. Weapon rack. There we have two weapon racks. Huh. Well, we do need more weapon racks just in case someone needs more weapon rack. Also, do you put bedrooms in barracks? I forgot. Let's see. Barracks may be defined from a bed, cabinet, container, weapon rack, or armor stand. Right, so we need all of those, I would feel. Well, we don't need all of those, but I'm going to put in all of those. Just to make it feel more legitimate, you know. We're not going to use the best beds, of course. We're going to put in four beds here. Yeah, sure. Alright, we have a barracks. We don't have a military in the barracks, but we do have a barracks. button. We need more door. Ah, that's being smoothed too. I just it just hasn't been smoothed yet. That's okay. There, let's say. And, uh, cabinet. And, uh, cabinet. And a cabinet in the, in this room too, believe it or not. No. 
No. There we go. <sighs> well, we've built all the beds that I ordered. Yeah, we might as well have them smooth the rest of this. Although we're going to be building, you know, bedrooms from it a later date. For God's sake, why did... Why do you dwarves always do this? You have beds. You're in a... You're on a bedroom layer and there are beds that aren't even bedrooms on this layer. You could sleep in one of them. Yet instead, you insist on sleeping on the floor. <sighs> Dwarves. need doors in here. That's we want mine, not doors. No. B and then D. Yes, like that. Okay, we're gonna tell them to put in a door, but because someone's standing there they might just cancel the job. No, they're putting in the door. Good. Good. Ah, there we go. I knew it would happen to something. No, unsuspend construction of that bed. <laughs> it's kind of the key to a bedroom. A bed. What would a bedroom be without a bed? Okay. What's this? Oh yeah, they even specified that it was a bed, but I didn't pay attention. What's that? Why is there a kid in the blood here? Oh, you've been bathing in it, haven't you? It's fine. It's fine. Are we? Why do we have no drinks again? For God's sake, I had this on repeat. Alright, brew me drinks now. Also, the traders haven't left, have they? I can see them in all their rings. Yep, that's Vukar. <sighs> Don't make me dismantle that trade depot. I will.
Okay, good. They're alternating between them. We're going to turn off the maximum priority now. Who are you two? And what are you doing here? Donkey. Another donkey. You don't seem to be pets, do you? Must have came with that migrant wave. Hmm. Well, we need more bones. You'll just starve if I don't. Let's get some more gems cut. Uh, which one though? What's the ones that we have the most of? I see a massive patch of purple. Is that amethyst? No, it's kunzites. Kunzites? I don't know how to say that properly. Which is a lot of things. <laughs> cut, 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 cut. And down here, let's just quickly add. Make me a. Uh, Llama wool dress, yes. And also while you're at it, some llama, some sheep wool trousers, yes. Also, we have a leather work somewhere, don't we? Leather works, leather works, leather works. Yeah, we do somewhere. I think it's over here. In the. Yeah, here it is. Well, we have plenty of leather, as, as you can see. So let's make some leather, leather stuff. Why, buy a leather shoe, does it literally just mean one shoe? It could, you know. I wouldn't put it past to a fortress. Well, whatever. Actually, maybe we should make two of the... I don't remember what material, but yeah, maybe we should make two. Just in case that is the case. One emu leather mitten and a second emu leather mitten. Emu, emu. Here we are. Alright. <sighs> oh, and the traders have left at long last. <laughs> Took you long enough, traders. <sighs> oh yeah, there's that tomb <laughs> that I set up. You know, oh, we're at a 
rough can zites, I guess I told them to cut them all. That's okay though. The chances of someone very specifically wanting can zite. Also this is a three by four. Also this is a three by two. I mean to be fair a lot of these are. I don't think it matters that much. I know I said that I kind of forced myself to be 4x4, four four, but I guess I wasn't counting very well. But that's fine. 3 and 4. Also, we're nearly out of doors. Make me 30 wooden doors. And you know what? Make me... Maybe 10 more beds just for fun. Also, how are we doing on wood? We are eating into that wood. So you know what? We're going to do something that we haven't done in a while. We're going to tell them to cut down a tree. Uh, which one? This one. These ones, rather. Yes, these three. We're going to tell them to cut down those three trees. So we have wood. Three trees should be more than enough for a good amount of time, you know. <laughs> it's like how the elves ask, don't cut down a hundred trees this year, and elves. I don't know what you think I'm going to use all that wood for. Do you know how much wood a hundred trees is? I mean, it would vary, but look how many, look how much wood that tree was. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, wait. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes. Six there. One, two, three. Three there, so nine. That one was a small one. Actually, look, they, it looks like they're picking up more than that. There was multiple on the same block, I see. So, yeah, that's a lot of... And look, d how many bits of wood are on this single tile now? One. But, bloody hell. Look, there's five there, and there's four there. So, that's at least over I'd say 20 possibly over 30 logs like you don't need that to cut down a hundred trees a year unless you're making like 8 million things out of wood I know I'm doing a wood doors like we cut down a bunch of trees at the start and we still have some I'm just being a bit paranoid about it Interrupted by a giant peach face lovebird. Ah, giant peach face lovebirds are making our dwarves upset. Damn them. They think they're so clever being giant and peach faced and lovebirds. I do like the specificity, but I don't like them bullying me dwarves. <laughs> Right. This is a bedroom. <sighs> and you know what? I think that that'll be it for today. In this fine dwarven fortress. So yeah. I don't even have a to-do list for next time. Because we kind of did everything. I mean, I suppose we could have started assigning things to the military. But that's not really a requirement, you know. So, yeah, I'll see you next time. Dwarf Fortress is not responding because it is saving. <laughs> I wonder if it'll still do that in the Steam release. I imagine that'd scare people if it did. <laughs>
<laughs> uh, anyway, see you next time. On time, Granite.